Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, you're watching The Legend of Zelda 94, and this is it. This is the final stretch of the game right here. We are chasing Donkey Kong to the top of the tower, and every level is a Donkey Kong level in this one. Okay, he didn't... Donkey Kong Jr. did not change the direction of the conveyor belt, so... Get a little bit of a speed booster. Oh, he's just... He's just dinking around. Probably is not going to sit too well with his dad. Although the, the slowness here is giving me a little bit of an advantage. Woo! Hello. Oh, no. Don't want to lose our handstand position yet. There we go. That went pretty well. The RNG was on our side for the first little half there. That doesn't always happen. Sometimes Donkey Kong Jr. will dance around at the Switch and not do anything. And sometimes that works to your benefit. Sometimes it doesn't. But yeah, every level's a Donkey Kong level. No keys, no doors, just pure chasing Donkey Kong up the tower action. We've got him on the ropes at this point. That's a simple level. Much simpler than it looks. I don't even know if I've ever seen the right-hand side of that level. You just have to backflip to the top of it. All right, here we go. Next up, these go, these go real quick, leading up to the final boss fight. All right, he was nice this time. He, he pulled the switch. Sometimes Donkey Kong Jr. won't pull the switch at the beginning of that level. <clears throat> and so you're just stuck waiting there for a second. I bet that sucks for speedrunners. Alright, so... But he's being pretty good about it today, so... Everything is working out. Everything's coming up Millhouse right now. There we go. Yeah, he did it every time. Instant grow back if you make it there. I love that. That poison mushroom did nothing. It was a yummy button mushroom. And here we go. Time to lock up Donkey Kong Jr. Get the get the red right hand out of the way first. Then we can concentrate on the big man himself. Donkey Kong, what are you doing? Donkey Kong's just sitting there letting this happen. Oh no, that was dumb. I wasn't watching. Well, good thing that's not fatal or anything. But we're like right there. We're there we are. I was going to say, we're right there on the end bit. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, that was fatal, though. Okay, so it can get too bad. I should have paid a little more attention there. But that was kind of funny. Okay. All right. Let's, let's be a little more serious this time. So Donkey Kong didn't, like, pull the switch for the first couple times there. He didn't let out one of those little raven guys until, like, near the end. Really? Boy, y'all are the worst at your, your little poop shots. Okay. There we go. Just narrowly avoided disaster there. <laughs> I love how Mario looks like, um, what? What do you want me to do? You think I'm actually going to save your life here? No, no. I'm going to move on. I got your dad to deal with. Oh my gosh. How could you get Donkey Kong on the toe like that? Donkey Kong is allergic to toe barrels. He just had a pedicure. And Mario went and ruined it. No wonder Donkey Kong is so angry. Alright, here we go. Leading up to the very end here. This is just a simple backflipping level right here. but This is basically just the first level. <laughs> But it's got some epic music backing it up, which is pretty great. I like how the farther in you get, the more epic the music gets. I mean, that's true of most games. Honestly, if a game isn't getting epic music toward the end, what are you doing? But it's just really noticeable in this game, because the soundtrack is so great. I've already gone on at length about Taisuke Araki. I don't need to do that again. Alright, up and up and up and up. There we go. Okay. Donkey Kong not allowing visitors right now. But the minute he does, I think it's one, two, three, one, two, three. There we go. Frame perfect. Dead on. The wind goes against, or the wind goes with you there in a way that can very easily be fatal. If you take too many rope swings, Donkey Kong will grab your face and launch you into next Tuesday. And we don't want that. Okay. What we want is to get out of here unscathed. Here we go. Whee. Whee. 
Oh, I really thought I was going to be little for a second. If you're little, that's it, basically. It's curtains. There's no waiting that thing out. You're essentially dead. So it's lucky that that one was as easy as it was. This level right here. Maybe my favorite song in the entire game. There is genuine metal happening in this song, and I don't know if we're going to hear it or not, because I intend to take care of this level pretty quickly, but I think this is actually even better than the actual final boss theme. And the poison mushroom comes out of the barrel. Those barrels are packed with yummy button mushrooms. Okay. All right. Two. This is going pretty well so far. Let's go ahead and let's take this down here. Oh, swing and a miss. Strike one. Okay, and a roll. Doing the Tootsie Roll. Thank you, Wind. That was the only reason I got over there as quickly as I did. There we go. Yeah, I didn't get to the cool part of the song. I knew I wasn't gonna. But there are some pretty, pretty awesome metal riffs in that song. Showdown at the Tower is the name of that song. I highly suggest you go look it up. It is one of my very most favorite pieces of video game music. Donkey Kong, that's not how you fly. You're not supposed to fly down, stupid. Well, it's your first time, so maybe I shouldn't be so hard on you. All right, there we go. 99 lives going into the final boss fight. I love how the head grins when you go into the level. 9-9, nine, nine. here we go. Love, once again, separated. Mario should be dead right now. But that is one head drop that he is programmed to survive. Alright, we're gonna get on Donkey Kong's nose here, make him sneeze, and we want to get to the top as soon as possible. And that is not how you do that. Okay. Alright. All right, eh, all right, we are at the top. There we go. It was a little messy, but that's how you do it. And now we got to jump to keep from being brought back to the bottom. All right, jump. Wow, I honestly, oh yeah, all the barrels are over there now. That's where they love hanging out, it is over on the right. Woo! Okay, well, I'll take that one. That's fine. Fine by me. Oh, no. Stuck on the bottom. That's not great. <coughs> it's okay. He's going to take a few seconds to regroup. He's going to come back with a new strategy. All right. This one is actually easier to get to the top from. So he's going to try to smash us between his fists here. There we go. Just a quick handstand. Well timed. Boom. Woo! Woo! Nature Boy Mario. Woo! Here we go. All right, perfect. That was a nice little handstand jump to the lower tier, if I do say so myself. Okay, all right, we're on top for the bad part. All right. Little intermission here. Takes us to the bridge. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh! That... Best recovery ever, followed by just the absolute worst. Ah, oh, man, that hurts. That's a tough little part to get through. The timing on the fists, you gotta be impeccable. Okay, but we can do this, we can do this, we got this. It's no problem. It's absolutely no problem whatsoever. Okay. All right, we made it up first try this time. We're recovering just fine. There we go. Woo! I think the wooing helps me with the timing. Woo! Woo! It sure does. All right. Phase two, back on it. Okay, we get to stay up here this time, so we don't have to get away from the from the dual fists of crushing. I like how he still tries that anyway, even though you are not inside his hands at all. Terrible. Terrible gambit, Donkey Kong. You can't even see anything between your fists. Do you think I turned tiny or something? Alright, he'll probably go back to... Yeah, I was gonna say. He'll probably go back to raised fists at this point. Alright. Second time. Let's not mess this up. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Alright. 
And, oh, same recovery! Oh! Oh, yes. I, I don't think I've ever done that in all my time playing Donkey Kong. And I just pulled it off twice. That was incredible. Alright, so, here we go. Phase 3 is pretty normal compared to the others. There we go. Alright, thank you for not breaking on the... Thank you for not breaking on the other barrel. I appreciate that game. That was probably the game giving me a nice little head nod there. And here we go. Hit number six is the last one. Donkey Kong's Reign of Terror over Miss Pauline is done. I've never seen that. Why is it... Why is it raining barbells? I'm seeing things here for the first time I've never seen before. Donkey Kong 94 is managing to impress me. Even in its final moments. Oh my gosh. Things are happening that have never happened before. I'm seeing things that I've never seen before. My adrenaline is running so high. Okay, I've never gotten this to work on an emulator. And I may have talked about this the first time I played Donkey Kong, but there's a little trick you can do here. If you have real hardware, try it out and let me know if it works. But you can do a soft reset here. Oh, thanks for not playing the music when you go to end credits. That's what we all love, Nintendo. Uh, there's supposed to be a song there, but I don't know why it didn't start playing. <laughs> we all just love watching credits in eerie silence. Watching the names of the people go by who made the games and the movies that we love possible. We don't want any music to go along with that. We don't want any stirring, epic finale music to go along with that. We want complete silence. That's what we want. But there's a trick you can do at the final screen there. Um, if you do a soft reset, A, B, start, select. If you do it right when Donkey Kong jumps into the freeze frame, it's like right when he goes when he goes wah and it goes to freeze frame. When I was a kid, I would do a soft reset there. And I've never gotten this to work on an emulator. but So I'm not going to try it here again. Um, but if you, if you do it on real hardware, if you soft reset at the right time, the music will play at like half speed. And I feel like I'm taking crazy pills talking about this because I've never heard anyone else bring this glitch up. But I swear it works. If you have a real Game Boy, test it out for me. Beat Donkey Kong 94, get to the little in cinematic there. And right when Donkey Kong jumps into freeze frame, do a soft reset. I don't know why anyone would want to play the game with half speed music, but it's possible. You could do it. Uh, and it does sound kind of fun to hear the songs at a slower tempo like that. I don't really know what it does for you. It's just another way to experience the game. Arcade Donkey Kong, copyright 1980, Nintendo. Donkey Kong 94 is now older than Arcade Donkey Kong was when Donkey Kong 94 was released. Donkey Kong Home Version, 1983. Giving up props for that. But here we go. Game Boy Donkey Kong, 1994. The one that matters. One of the greatest games of all time. Happy to go through it again. Had myself a blast. But that is it. Coming up next, the love child of Link's Awakening and Sokoban. 